American Pickers star Mike Wolf's new Tennessee restaurant, yet to open five months after completing construction. Hello everyone, my name is Alana B. Welcome back to my another video. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up American Pickers star Mike Wolf's new Columbia. Tennessee restaurant remains closed five months after completing renovations in no November Mike 60 owns properties in Columbia, Tennessee, including bike shop, Columbia Motor Alley two lanes guest, house vacation rental and more the U.S. Sun previously reported the American Picker Star planned to open a restaurant where a former wine bar used to be now. The U.S. Sun can exclusively reveal the Erie remains unopened five months after completing construction in November. 2023, a town claimed it used to be a vintage wine bar and lounge. They closed that down and Mike Wolf bought it and built that it's just sitting there. I don't know what they're doing with it. A second insider claimed the space currently acts as an outdoor seating area for the next door restaurant Prime and pint the U.S. Sun previously revealed. Photos of the finished product of the outside area from November. 2023, the front of the restaurant has a wood wind prolo with lights streaming from the beams. There are gray pavers. Under the prolo with concrete for the rest of the space, the fire pit area also has pavers as there is a brick bench for customers to sit around the fire. There are pavers that are elevated which will act as a stage for karaoke performers. The outdoor area is lined with a black metal gate and brick planter boxes with shrubs along with other greenery. American Pickers star Mike Wolf kisses. Girlfriend Letitia Clean outside of his Tennessee bike shop in sweet PDA moment. According to property records viewed by the U.S. Sun, Mike dropped $600,000 on the property on September 15, 2022. The 976 feet red and white building, which was built in 1953, remains untouched as the inside has construction materials. The U.S. Sun previously obtained photos of when the property was under construction, a source claimed at the time. It's going to be a restaurant, they're going to sell pizza, soda, that kind of stuff construction. Workers are building a stage for karaoke. A fire pit and a parola in front of the building Mike even stopped by the property on the morning of November 3 to check out the progress in photos obtained by the U.S. Sun Mike was seen. Showing workers Eve ex exactly what to do to execute his vision Mike has kept. Instagram followers up to date on the progress as he posted a photo on Instagram of the outside of the building. With construction workers hard at work in November, he captioned the photo it's time to choose plants for the 1940s ESO Station Courtyard Project. This property will have an intimate unique experience. In the heart of Visa Columbia Tian, Historic district come see all this little town has to offer big thanks to it money Uncore design for helping make. All the green decisions he also posted. In late November when I first came to Columbia Tan six years ago, this building immediately caught my eye through all of the changes over the years. This little ESO service station has managed to weather the storm so many of these places have been scraped from the earth. Erasing such a big part of transportation history in America, I feel incredibly blessed to have had the opportunity to reimagine how this property could continue to serve the community this outdoor space will create memories for years to come also in town. Is Mike's vacation rental two lanes and his car garage Columbia Motor Alley, the American Picker Star is working to give. The small town which is about an hour. South of Nashville New Life according to property records one commercial property rented out to Hazelwood Laboratories is 4,320 square eft and valued at $214,100. Mikey also became the owner of a $2,900 FT property with a value of $192,700 that Moo Two Coffee rents out. Another commercial property is 4,653 eft and is appraised at $336,600.
The space is a drama theater called. Packard Playhouse Mike also purchased a 3. 3,166 feet home for $700,000 on May 20, 2022 in the small town, a source told the U.S. Sun then. Mike's project to revamp Columbia is costing $1.93 million, the inside added. The town is happy Mike is taking this on to help bring new life to Columbia topics. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. American Pickers and stay with us.